webinar where you can learn how to overcome your low self-confidence if you have it in the online or potential clients this is such a big big issue for many people who want to learn how to because number one they don't see the clients at the same time they're afraid of them <laughs> with me tonight is our special guest miss anna mrs annaline okay and she's going to tell you all about her experience when she started as a virtual professional annaline has this distinct uh distinct uh, uh, advantage friend can everybody type the word advantage annaline Galing, di ba? <laughs> because annaline actually hires virtual professionals uh, using uh, really, really and her her clients has lot who are interested in hiring virtual professionals she's actually uh, like several levels higher than a beginner because she she actually hires people like you guys okay so let's see if she, she's already online um you're gonna be hearing for her and can use sites into the future if you get know the future type word I want the okay. speaker in the upcoming summit. Okay, so new. Okay. Are you ready? Can you type the word ready so we can get started. So my name is John Hilayo and I teach people how to work on line and this uh if you see some people at the back in this picture these are some of the people i've helped in the past the event is called the um brother bo sanchez wealth summit and every year every march i feature people who are actually working at home on stage in bicc so at the very least, you know this thing is real. We yeah, have stories every year. So PICC. This is I think this is the second time I did this. We've been doing this, I think, for four years now, going on the fifth year. Right? So I have children, I have four children. This is one of this is one of my kids, see Sean. We them and we start we are also home and which is such a challenge i have no idea okay another one of the kids is lucia small in the picture sajayan and the kids pictures are blurred sajad in lahat yan because <laughs> the point is the point is i'm a filipino here in the philippines enjoying what the country gives at the same time experiencing all the disadvantages of being a filipino and at the same time taking advantages of the what the internet has given to us, and that's virtual careers. Now, into that issue, you should know that as of seven, so two, three, four years ago, there were 53 million American work. Now, there's between, hey, I'm a, I'm a freelance architect. That's not freelance online work. work. The this stat is actually only freelance online work, and there's 53 million Americans doing that. Okay, comparatively, that's like half the, the population of the Philippines doing online freelancing. The term virtual career is a term I used to describe this phenomenon called freelancing, specifically for us Filipinos because uh, we needed a new name para hindi tayo maloko ng mga mga tao na ha freelance ka ha ha libre ka ha ha kasi freelance ka di ba so para people don't mock us when we do online freelancing i came up with the word virtual careers and that came out in my book virtual careers of the same title which is available in philippine bookstores okay so that's my short introduction to myself and found into the world and and uh, vacationing in many different places 
uh, around the world, though you you won't notice it because I don't brag. Okay, was <laughs> at the same time, not only that I, I'm also encouraging everyone to do the same thing, no, to to stop your future enjoyment to the future and at the same time enjoy your life today because you will not be this age today and retirement will come once but you'll be too old to enjoy most of the things that you can enjoy you know like echo trail hiking and that but yes i've done that you really can't really enjoy echo trail hiking you know yung maraming bundok, no? if you're like a 65 year old do that now right so yeah so count the cost so let's uh move forward to our guest uh Annaline, nandiyan ka na ba? yes but earlier i'm clear clearly uh, hello sir naririnig nyo ko yeah give the Hello, sir. Yeah, she's in the okay. and she's in her careers. Um, hello. Okay, loud and clear. Okay. It's kasi medyo naghahang, uh, medyo naghahang yata, sir, sa side ko. So, pag hindi clear, um, pasabi na lang po, sir, ha? I-cut nyo na lang ako. Ano, ano, sorry, hindi ka narinig. Ha, <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. Um, ano, sir, uh, para kasi naghahang sa side ko, in case, sir, na uh, naghahang ako or hindi nyo ako gaano maintindihan, pakikat nyo lang po ako. Hindi, para kang ano, katabi ko. Sobrang okay. Sobrang linaw. Okay. Wala, Sige. wala. Wala lang sinasabot. <sighs> ano rin is also married with one kid, I think. And Anyway, go. Go, Annaline. Okay, so can I start now? Go for it. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. Um, thanks, Sir Jomar, sa pag-invite ulit. Uh, 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 ang i-discuss ko today is how to overcome your low self-confidence in dealing with clients or potential clients. Okay. Again, pag malabo ako, paki, uh, sabihan nyo lang po ako, ha? Okay. So, again, la- let me introduce myself. I'm Annaline Roque. Um, I live in Cainta-Rizal. I'm married with one son. And we're also living with our lolos and lolas. So, kasama namin sila sa bahay. Kaya, masaya. And, uh, uh, may apat din kami magkakapatid. Tatlong babae, tsaka isang lalaki. Tapos, hilig namin ng kumain. At tsaka, follower ako ni Brother Bo Sanchez. Doon ko nakilala si Sir Jomar sa isa sa email ni Brother Bo about work from home and doon nag-umpisa lahat. Okay, so yung trabaho ko with regards to my work, dati akong instrument technician, yun ang unang-una ko nakuha ang trabaho. Nag-aayos kami ng mga aircon, tsaka mga flow flow ng mga tubig sa shell, malampayas, mga ganon. So pinapadala kami doon. So pandalaking job. Yung pangalawa ko namang trabaho is as a call center agent sa teleperformance kami yung first batch ng sprint and um, then quality analyst and then ang pinaka huling trabaho ko sa corporate world is RR Donnelly sila naman yung mga sa insurance and ang ginagawa ko dun is process analyst dating quality analyst and then associate client manager and then na promote sa process analyst so yung na-realize ko habang nagtatrabaho ako is habang tumataas pala yung posisyon mo, mas yung oras mo at yung responsibility mo, mas lumalaki. So, yung oras mo sa trabaho is humahaba. So, parang kulang na kulang na yung oras ko sa family ko. So, doon ako napapaisip na kung kailangan ko pa bang ituloy yun. So, syempre, nagkakasakit ka. So, doon ko nakuha yung mga hypertension ko kasi sobrang stress. Um, so, tapos, naka 
nakapakinig kasi ako kay Brother Arun Gong na ng isa sa talk niya. Ito yung dahilan kung bakit talaga ako nagpursige na iwanan ko yung uh, day job ko. Kasi pang umaga rin to eh. So yung day job, yung corporate work ko, kahit mataas yung sinusweldo ko. Kasi mas narealize ko na mas importante pa rin yung family. Sabi kasi ni Brother Arun dun sa talk niya, um, to be in your children's memories of tomorrow, you have to be in your lives to, in their lives today. So, yun dun ko nare-realize sa pagpapasok, ay iyak, iyak siya, tapos kailangan hinahabol ka palagi. So, yun, sabi ko, kailangan ko na siyang, uh, i, i, kailangan ko na mag-decide. Pero, sobrang dami ko kasing takot, kasi syempre, as a virtual assistant, um, nag-iisip kasi ako, totoo ba talaga na ano, kikita ba ako? Ano ba mangyayari sa buhay ko? Kasi mag-uumpisa pa lang ako. That was 2014 uh, to, to three years ago. So, um, yan. Uh, sobrang nakatatakot din ako kasi syempre ang dami kong utang. So, yung utang namin is bahay, sasakyan. So, uh, ba diba? So, uh, kasi uh, sobrang talagang ano eh, uh, na- nakakaya naman bayaran. Kaya lang gusto ko syempre ma-fully paid at the same time credit card loan um so wao na ako sa credit card as in nasa 400,000 plus pag pinagsama-sama mo so sabi ko ah, wala pa ako gaano savings so paano ba ako magre-resign at mag-uumpisa ang naisip ko uh, as yung yung self confidence ko talaga bagsak hindi ko talaga alam kung anong gagawin ko pero yung pag iniisip mo yung emotional why mo or yung gusto mong gawin para para umpisahan mo yung virtual assistant is uh, mas matindi. So, ang ginawa ko, um, in-examine ko ano ba yung ngayon dahilan ng bakit ako natatakot, bakit mababa yung self-esteem ko, at saka bakit wala talaga akong confidence para gawin ko yung tingin ko na magandang opportunity sa bahay. Unang-una kasi inalam ko na okay, na, na natatakot ako kasi hindi ko nga alam kung ano yung pupuntahan ko. Unang-una, paano ba ako mababayaran? Totoo ba to? May kliyente ba ako makukuha? Um, paano ako kukuha? Saan ako kukuha? Sinong mga... Alam mo yon sobrang gulong-gulo ang isip ko noon. Pero again, at, uh, naisip ko na meron pa rin akong faith na uh, parang meron eh, meron something, may, may, may gold sa, sa likod ng virtual assistant na trabaho. And naisip ko rin is, again, ang fear may dalawang meaning, forget everything and run, or face everything and rise. So, the choice is yours. So, syempre, ang pinili ko yung pangalawa, I have to face everything and rise. Anong ginawa ko? Yung ginawa ko, una-una, nag-take ako ng mga online courses, naghanap syempre ako ng mentor, Nag-join ako ng mga seminar, nagbasa ako ng mga books, nag-join ako ng mga groups, and then hindi yan try, action. Okay, so action yan. So, pakipura yung try. Um, nag-invest talaga ako sa sarili ko. So, yan. Umatend ako ng mga date with freedom, kasama si na Sir Jomar, tsaka yung mga dati niyang students. So, doon ko narinig kasi marami ako narinig doon ng mga, ng mga nagsasabit, nagsasa, nag ang mga mga totoong VA na na ginagawa na talaga yung VA work. So mas lalong nadagdagan yung self confidence ko na wait kakayanin ko to. Tapos nag yun may video pa ako doon sa sa Date with Freedom na yun na gusto ko magtayo ng VA company. So yun na interview rin kami doon. So, tinransform ko lang yung takot ko sa action. Pero, ayun, tsaka yung laging sinasabi rin ni Brother Bo na kailangan para may mangyari sa huwag ka sa comfort zone mo. Kailangan lilipat ka sa courage zone mo. So, huwag ka matatakot kasi yung pag-grow mo talaga nandoon sa medyo kabilang side. Hindi pwedeng nasa comfort zone ka parate. Again, yung mga kinakatakutan ko, syempre sa umpisa na ginagawa mo yung, yung, yung virtual assistant Uh, na wala ka pa talagang gaanong alam kaya nga naging ginawa ko, nag-aral talaga ako is yung una, yung income ko talagang nawala kasi ano eh uh, nag-resign ako eh nag-resign talaga ako sa trabaho ko tapos habang ganun lang, ganun kasi kalakas yung fate ko na makakakuha ko ng virtual assistant job, lalo na nung nag-aral ako nag-aral ako ng mga mga tutorials na yung mga downloaded na tutorials si Sir Jomar plus hinabol na ako ng mga credit cards ko so talaga nakaka-receive na ako ng mga, ng mga Uh, collections collections department ng mga sulat talaga nananakot na sila pero again, if you feel like quitting think about why you started and don't give up just because things are hard sabi ko, wait, kailangan ko itong ituloy kasi kung babalik ako sa employment ganun, naman yung, ganun na naman mangyayari sa akin tapos yung traffic pa, hindi ko na kaya yung traffic kasi talagang yung oras mo sa traffic nakaka 
ang sakit sa ulo. Hindi, hindi ko na talaga siya kaya. So, after... Ayan, nakakuha ko ng first client ko after four months. And as a general VA. So, naging ano ko, sa admin, admin. So, syempre, pag admin ka, hindi naman talaga ganun kakipa ang salary. Pero, dun muna ako nag-umpisa. Pag admin ka, uh, sabi ko, sige, okay to. Kahit na nag-cut down ako ng salary. So, ang ginawa ko lang, ito yung para, para talagang, syempre, sa umpisa, takot pa rin ako eh. Paano bang gagawin ko sa kliyente ko na to? So, lahat ng negative thoughts ko, tinanggal ko, pinalitan ko siya ng mga, mga positive thoughts. Tsaka, syempre, action. Action na wait. Kailangan ko mag-serve at mag-serve ako genuinely na parang negosyo ko yung negosyo ng client ko. So, ibig sabihin, anong ginawa ko? Ang ginawa ko, gumawa ko ng way para matulungan ko si client na kahit hindi niya sabihin sa akin. So, hanggang sa yun, nag, nag, nag yung mga fruits of labor ko, kasi hindi ako nagpapa, yung mga overtime, talagang gumagawa ako Saturday, Sunday, hindi ko kinakount yun. So, as a virtual assistant kasi, minsan, wait lang, kailangan ko ba mag-overtime? Paano to? Ano na to? Ha? Parang outside office hours na yun. Wala ko, hindi ko iniisip na babayaran ba nila ako doon o hindi. Basta importante ang nasiisip ko, tutulungan ko si client kasi alam ko, dadali ang buhay nila. Tapos, yun, tapos yung, yung genuine na makaserve ka sa kanila. Hanggang sa yun, nagtudere-derecho, uh, nakaka-receive na ako ng mga, ng mga, ng mga commendations nila. Tapos, yun, ang naiisip ko rin yun, when you do more than you're paid for, eventually, you'll be paid for more than you do. Zigzaglar. And then, always deliver more than what is expected. So, yan yung mga moto ko habang ginagawa ko yung trabaho. So, nakakakuha ko na minsan from US, pinadala nila ako ng mga notebooks, mga uh, regalo. Tapos, minsan, in terms of money, nagbibigay sila ng bonuses. Kasi, ano sila yung hard work mo as American, hindi nila yon ma... ma Um, talagang na, 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 na notice nila yon So, biglaan ka nalang papadalhan ng kung ano-ano. And then, so, ito rin, lagi kong iniisip na if your presence doesn't doesn't add value, your absence won't make a difference. So, yung mga ginagawa ko, kasi may training ako kay Sir Jomar, ang isa talaga sa nakatulong sa kanila is, yung sa training kasi ni Sir Jomar, meron siya doong gawa ka ng tutorial. So, ginawa ko kasi yon Yung tutorial ko nga lang, dahil hindi ko natapos yung assignment kay Sir Jomar, yung, yung energy ko, doon ko nailagay sa client ko na yon So, yung tutorial, ang ginawa ko sa kanilang tutorial para sa client ko. So, simula noon, yan, nakaka-receive na ako ng mga email. Uh, yung mga nagre-resign, bumabalik sila sa akin na lahat, uh, naghahanap daw sila ng mga super talented VA, tapos kailangan nila, kat, yun nga, maka, makatulong sa kanila. Tapos yung sabihin nila sa akin anong mga requirements nila. Tapos yan, sunod-sunod na siya, i-refer na nila ako looking for virtual assistant. Hanggang sa takabuo ako ng team ng mga virtual assistant at hanggang ngayon nag-hire pa rin ako. Nag-hire kami kasi may mga may mga kumukuha talaga kasi through referral, through word of mouth. Hindi ko pa pinapagana yung Facebook marketing or Facebook ads. Pero doon, um, nakakakuha talaga kami. Kasi pag yung trabaho mo talaga is maayos. So yan, looking for a VA. Tapos, um, yan, uh, may merong paminsan yung, yung client ko. Pag, pag nagbigay siya, sure, bull na, as in, interview agad. Nintroduce na niya ako, tapos, okay, ah, okay, kukuha na sila, o sigurado na, okay, so, pag, ano na naman ako, hadap na naman ako ng VA. Tapos, ang, ang lagi ko kasi iniisip, gusto ko, uh, maramdaman kasi, may coach kasi, ang, ang sikreto ko, ko kasi doon sa tingin ko is, um, ini, iniisip ko yung, yung uh, nagko-coach, Gin, nag, yung sarili ko naging uh, in, in, in upgrade ko yung level na maging coach din ako so gusto ko ma-regate yung ginagawa ko yung passion ko sa mga VA kasi pag nag ka ng VA mararamdaman mo talaga kung yung VA ba na yon is nagtatrabaho lang ba siya dahil dahil wala lang gusto niya lang magtrabaho o nagtatrabaho siya dahil love niya yung ginagawa niya mararamdaman mo yun sa VA na maha-hire mo eh so kailangan ma-regate mo sa kanya ma-develop mo siya na kung ano kung paano yung malasakit mo dun sa kumpanya dapat yung VA na na-hire mo is ganun din so yun yung mga yun yung sinasabi ko din sa mga client na yung care kaya ang pop tagline namin is virtual professionals caring for your business kasi pag naramdaman nila yon everything else will follow may mga client talaga kami ginawa na akong partner tapos sabi nila sa akin okay gusto ko na sa yung lahat ng sa yun ako kukuha ng VA ayoko na kay ganito although hindi ako nakikipagkompetensya pero pag naramdaman kasi nila yung service ng team um 
na nakukuha namin yung ano nila, yung trust nila dahil nga hindi ko sila pinababayaan. Minsan nga napapamper ko eh pero yun talaga eh kasi kailangan gagawin mo yung yung trabaho na nagfa-fire up ka, na nag-iignite ka every day. At tong trabaho kasi na to as a virtual assistant, every day talaga nagfa-fire up ako eh. Ito talaga yung ito talaga yung vision ko, ito yung goal ko, makatulong sa mga... Kasi everyday na amaze pa rin ako na, na may kausap akong Amerikano, may kausap ako sa kabilang mundo, sa ibang oras nila, tapos uh, nasiservan mo sila, natutuwa sila. So, sobrang sarap sa pakiramdam na parang hindi ka nagtatrabaho, parang hobby mo lang na ginagawa yung mga yon Tapos yun, ano yung nangyari sa buhay namin ngayon? Siyempre, yung oras mo sa family mo, mas magi mas dumami kasi nakaka-attend ako sa mga events hindi na ako laging absent sa kanila nakakapasyal na kami kasama namin yung mga pamangkin ko mga bata nakaka-attend ako ng mga reunion so iba hindi maka-attend kasi nga yung iba may trabaho so yun uh, mga mga kasama ko mga housewife tapos yung credit card namin nabayaran na namin in full at the same time yung dati uma-attend kami ng mga corporate team building ngayon may mga sim Paul na team building din kami. Tapos kasama yung mga virtual assistant family members. Tapos dati, umaaten kami ng mga Christmas party. Ngayon, nagpapa-Christmas party rin kami para magkita-kita yung mga VAs. Tapos, ang pinaka-importante sa lahat, um, nakaka gumagawa kami yung mga VA. Yung goal kasi ng team is makapag-serve. So, uh, sinasama namin yung mga VA, virtual assistant to serve. Like, last Sunday lang, nasa ano kami, nasa He Cares Foundation. Exactong anniversary ng He Cares. So, naka, na 300 plus children yon na sin nerve ng team na so, sobrang saya na yun nga na nakakatulong ka at the same time ginagawa mo yung virtual assistant work mo na na, na yung oras mo is nasa iyo talaga so um, at the same time yon so ang lagi niyo ring tatandaan na pag pagpapasok kayo lahat naman kasi ma- sa umpisa mahirap so Um, every pro was an amateur, was once an amateur. Every expert was once a beginner. So dream big and start now. So lahat nagumpisa talaga sa maliit, lahat nagumpisa sa 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 mahirap. Pero pag nalagpasan mo yon, uh, sigurado uh, makukuha mo yung fruit of labor. So again, lagi yung tatandaan na lahat kayo is awesome. So lahat yon um, makukuha nyo rin. Okay, so yun lang po for today. Hope may natutunan kayo. And yun, so we're hiring. <laughs> yun lang. Sige po. So yun lang po, uh, sir. Okay na po ako, sir. Yun na po. Hello, thank you very much. Ang um, bilis-bilis naman nun. Ay, sorry. Um, Did did anyone learn anything and would you like to learn more? Yes, dale. Go back to it. Mas maganda. Give you mas maganda siguro. Mamit niyo si Annalyn. Ano siya niyo? Do, would you like to meet Annalyn or ano lang, how to be you lang hanggang how to be you look you lang hanggang doon lang tayo sa how to be you <laughs> mas maganda bang ma-meet niyo siya o how to be you lang <laughs> o how to be hired by you ano mag ano sa tingin niyo maganda ma-meet niyo in person o hanggang malayo na lang ang tingin so cuz um that i hear that a lot and i think i think it's a lot better if you meet the people no so i i want to join your Team, alam niyo bang <laughs> hindi pa ding basta-basta sumalang, basta-basta. <laughs> Di ba? Hindi pa ding basta-basta sumalang. Oh, oh, malayo kayo, pero pwede niyo kasi i-meet virtually kasi like tonight, 'di ba? Na-meet niyo siya virtually. And there are many ways to do that. Di ba? Because Annalyn, I've actually invited Annalyn to speak in the upcoming Date with Freedom Summit. The Date with Freedom has many many meetups. The same is for you, the webinar style, no? Ano maka, usap-usap, ganyan-ganyan. Um, sino bang interested sa ganun? Okay. okay. Before to that, 
I just like to repeat some stuff na sinabi ni Anlin na masakit. Sin- sino dito ang ano? Gustong <laughs> tong ma-relieve ang mga magagandang sinabi ni Annalyn na masakit. Ako, ako. Sandali. Memories of your children, you have to be in their lives today. Ulitin ko ha. Sabi ni Brother Arun kay Annalyn. To be in the memories of your children, you have to be in their lives today. Uy, galing. Totoo yan. So, masakit. So, review lang yan. <laughs> review lang yan. <laughs> ah, okay? Tapos, meron pa siya isang, ano, meron pa siyang isang uh, sinabi. Dali ah. Hanapin ko lang, hanapin ko lang. Sakit ba? Sabi sa inyo, masakit yan eh. Sabi ito, ito. Is face everything and rise. Di ba? Fear yan. F-E-A-R. Meron tayong bagong definition. Yan. Actually, hindi nyo lang alam. Mahirap makasama lagi, anak. Boy namin. But it's a better problem to have than makasama. Yeah. Kasi nagkaanak ka pa, di ba? Hindi naman kasama. Uh, see, there's this big balance everybody needs to accomplish, no? So, na hindi lang lagi mong kasama because um, sinasabi ko sa inyo, mababaliw kayo pag lagi mong kasama ang anak niyo. Okay? It's not healthy. Okay? Pero, mababaliw din kayo kung hindi nyo kasama ang anak niyo all the time. Like, 20 years, 5 years, hindi nyo kasama. Parang, you, you, ano... Yeah, iiyak ka every morning. That's unfortunate. Unfortunately, it was the, our choice before the internet was there. And it was our choice not to believe during that time. Pero ngayon, since nandito na kayo, mayroon na kayong bagong choice to believe something better. Di ba, Annalyn? Something really, really better. So, ano yan? Gamit sa, ano, sa pag-drive. Tanat ang tanong ni Domingo. Um, ah, nag-a-apply na. <laughs> Hindi ganyan. <laughs> Hindi ka dyan. <laughs> okay. Pwede, pwede ko bang kainturuan? Paano mag-apply? Pwede ba? Paano mag-apply? So, there are two ways to apply. Yung mabilis, na sigurado, o yung mabagal, na sigurado. Di ba? And a lot of you will, will, try, will try to choose na mo, sigurado. Tama? <laughs> yung, pag nag-apply ka, mabilis, uh, uh, tapos maka-hire ka agad. Pero sinasabi ko sa inyo, you will have to invest a lot in yourself. Di ba? Ang dami. Ano rin, nandiyan ka pa ba? Labas mo nga yung slide mo na, ito yung mga ginawa ko, four things, five things, six things. Mayroon kang slide na ano eh. Uh, ah, sige pa. Six things, may mentor, may seminar, may try, ganyan. Ito mo mabilis eh. So, you know, I'm just gonna... Yeah, see, see, look at that. Investing yourself says, take online courses, like the Date with Freedom. Um, ask mentors. Humble yourself. Hirap yan, ha? Humble yourself and ask mentors. Join seminars. Kung meron ka sa city mo, kung hindi, online yan. Or if you're gonna be like me, you travel to another country to attend seminars. Read books. Kung wala kang books, bumili ka sa Amazon. Join in part- a lot of groups. May local groups, may foreign groups, mayroong online groups. And really try it. Kaya ang sinasabi ko, to get your first job, Siguro mga tatlong buwan, uh, kasama na yung struggle and katamaran. <laughs> so, ano rin ikaw, ganun katagal for the first job? Four months. Apat na buwan. Tapos Apat. ano yun? At, at four months, ano yan? Um, admin. Admin pa lang yan, ano? Admin job. Admin job pa lang. 
So, hindi ka agad, tanggap ka, oo, pero hindi ka mataas ang kita agad. Right? So, yun yung, ano, yun yung pass na nangyari kay Annalyn. How many years ago was this? Three years ago? Three years ago. Ayun, oh, tatlong taon ang nakalipas. I don't suggest you take the same path. Taas ang kamay. Gusto niyo bang mas magandang path? <laughs> Or the same identical path? Hindi kasi parehong client sa makukuha niyo eh. Hindi ang galing ng client niyo na rin eh. Okay. Maybe that's the big thing that most people don't understand. Everybody, can you type the word bagay? Daan dyan, or mga clients dyan, a match. It has to be a great match. If the match is great, okay, um, you'll enjoy it, and your client will enjoy it, and you'll both enjoy it. Kaya it will pop up a level na, okay, you want to be my partner in this. Kaganyan yung kanil client, di ba? Yeah. Tama si Tina. So, yan. Okay. So, event, Tina, Tina. It's, that's a basic and not basic event. Pero, kasi, because it's it's based on... Saan na ba yun? This question. I'm gonna show you the question. It says, totally remove your fear of virtual careers. Oh, who wants to totally remove your fear of working on the internet? And the way we do this, uh, uh, this virtual careers fear removal, is you are going to be put in a room where you talk to 20 plus virtual professionals live. Parang dating. Kaya nga date with freedom. Parang speed dating, pero hindi siya speed. It's slow. Ang speed dating kasi you get like three minutes or five minutes with one person. And then after a few minutes, seconds, you have another person. Um, hindi yan ang style ng date with freedom. Date with freedom is 10 hours long. <laughs> okay. And we put in in the room mga, you know, uh, 20 plus virtual professionals so you can actually, you can actually talk to them. Uh, and you're actually being going to be put in a situation na map mag-uusap kayo, and if you are super introverted, you will be listening to the conversations of other people because it's in your table. It's not, it's not going to happen sa, ano na, ay, nakatayo kayo, cocktail, cocktail, walang pumapansin sa'yo kasi parang sayawan, hindi, hindi ganun. You will be listening to other conversations. And the persons, all the speakers, you get, you get to talk to all the speakers. Not just, not just the speakers, also people who are not speakers, People who hire virtual professionals like Annalyn, who's one of the speakers, you're also going to be hearing from uh, other people who hire, and we're also going to be hearing from other kinds of people involved in the world of a virtual professional. In the last event we did, um, we invited relatives of virtual professionals to talk about their experience. Nung hindi sila makapaniwala ang kapatid ko nagtatrabaho sa internet. Yeah. So um, that's one of the ways we we do to get, re remove the 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 fear of virtual careers. Because kahit na nasa virtual careers ka na, sometimes you think hanggang dito na lang ba? Hindi pa pwede umakyat ang sweldo na to or ito lang ba talaga lahat? Baka naman may iba pa. You know what I mean? Marami kasi because since you are working in the internet, there's a ton of potential out there. So the word that you can use to face everything and then rise above it. Sobrang daming potential. So there's going to be a lot of 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. that you will not run out of things to say. At the same time, if you run out of questions to ask, we're all for you never to even run out of questions. If you forget the questions, actually we prepared questions for you to ask already. So wala ka nang ma wala kang problema. Okay, don't. Now, the, the, the big difference of Date with Freedom, the seminar, or actually it's not a seminar na, kasi a seminar is you sit there, you know, magsasalita sila, magna-notes ka, hindi. Um, there's a lot of time for talking with each other, like each hour is talking with each other, 50% of each hour 
30 minutes, 30 minutes talk. May, mag, may magta-talk sa harap and 30 minutes mag-uusap-usap kayo sa tables. And the the unique thing about this is this it's recorded. Okay? It's recorded. And and record natin yung live event, record natin yung meetups. There's going to be meetups before the live event. And announcement, the meetup is happening this Saturday. The first meetup is happening this Saturday. So that's why I I mentioned we have an, uh, Andrea last week. Andrea says speaker also because there's going to be a meetup happening this saturday so ang tanong, are you going to be there okay uh, more than 100 people have already registered to the date with freedom i already know coming into this year na it's going to be the, one of the biggest uh, attended date with freedom events kaya kumuha kami ng venue na kasi ang app okay so um our first live event happening this uh, weekend, this Saturday, um, is all about something that I've been mentioning for several weeks now. It's called future apps. Everybody type the word future apps, okay? So, I'm gonna look for some of the slides. All right. So, the future apps is part of this thing called the fantastic future course now before i tell you all about um this one i'm gonna i'm gonna tell you a story about this car that the tesla model 3. now if you have i know if you have been listening to me in our brand new channel a brand new app and if you've been paying attention to the Facebook group, Jomar Hilario Virtual Careers, alam nyo na tong kwento na to. Pero kung hindi pa, sige, kwento ko sa inyo. Pakitype nga to encourage me, Jomar, ikwento mo ang, ang Tesla na kotse. So you are not looking at a fake car. Actually, okay, knobs, wala nang, minalagyan ng tubig. Ayun, minalagyan ng tubig. Wala nang, anything all right the whole slot there's an aircon slot and this big lap, laptop that's not an ipad that's really part of the car okay model three and the curious thing about um the future is that the future is actually here it's already here now ang problema lang ang experience natin of the future is really um not well distributed like for example um today there are no electric cars in the Fil in the philippines maybe there's one kay Manny Pangilinan, uh, that's most likely a tesla and ang sinasabi nilang ano electric car ay yung mga toyota okay prius actually hindi full electric car yun. that's like partial partial lang bottom line in july 20 2003 nagawa yung Tesla na car company and siguro around eight years or seven years ago nagawa nila yung first car nila and there are people around the world um, driving an electric supercar when I say supercar it's uh it's a sports car yung sobrang bilis na kotse mabilis mag-accelerate mabilis umandar and for those people everybody say the word para sa nila for those people the future has arrived um, di ba? Parang kay Annalyn ngayon, inisip mo, pwede ba akong mag-hire ng virtual assistants din, katulad ni Annalyn, and have a great relationship with my clients? Yes, for her, the future has arrived. Di ba, Annalyn? And the future, for you, hindi pa totoo. The future has not arrived. Now, there is a way for us to make sure the future will be distributed to us faster okay and that's the fantastic future course now going back to the car um because the other week okay the other week um ni release ni, ni tesla itong kochi mismo na nakikita nyo ngayon the model 3 um, um weird yung pricing nila 1 million pesos lang yan 600 700 thousand an electric supercar that doesn't have doesn't consume gas wala siyang tambucho okay <laughs> wala eh wala tambucho um it's super quiet is about 
to be released this year. Actually, na-release na pala. Na-release na yung first batch of, ano, of Model 3s in the U.S. this year. So, the streets of the U.S. will start becoming... Now, the Tesla is not your concern. Kasi, kasi pag pumunta sa Pilipinas, 3 million pesos na naman yan. Kasi, di ba, 3, 1 million yung cost ng kotse. Nalagyan ng tax. Eh, luxury car. Kasi, supercar yan eh. Gagawin na lang 3 million yan. Kahit na electric yan. Walang gasolina. The important thing is na iinggit ngayon ng Toyota, ang Honda, ang GM, ang Chrysler, lahat sila inggit. So this year, nagre-release na ng mga electric cars yung mga yan. Which means to say, hindi lang sila basta magre-release ng electric car. Nakita ko na eh. Yung electric car na i-release ng isang competitor, GM ata, maliit. Hindi siya supercar. Hindi siya mukhang sports car. Pag ang kotse kasi ginawa mong mukhang ordinaryo, mas mura yan. Okay, so magre-release na sila ng mga electric cars na mo, for the ordinary people. Hindi na 3 million pesos yan. Baka, baka balik sa 1 million na naman yan, electric car. When that happens, within 5 years, tatahimik na ang Pilipinas. <laughs> ang Philippine traffic, dadami na ang electric cars, bababawat na ang pollution. Actually, regarding cars, okay, is the future is already existing to, to other people. Eight years ago. Ngayon lang, nagsisimula pa lang ang future of electric cars sa Pilipinas. Okay? Ngayon, what does that mean to you? In the same way sa buhay ng virtual professional, no? Ayan, sabi nga ni Melvin, gusto ko mag-open ng agency. Hindi po ganun kadali yun. <laughs> Gagawa ka ng agency. Kung hindi nyo lang alam, ang sakit na ulo na ini-experience ni Annalyn sa, sa agency niya. Okay? Kasi ako nag-advise ako kay Annalyn eh. At saka yung mga loopholes, yung mga loopholes ng mga tao, those things happen. And he, you can't just, okay, I just want to make an agency. That's it. That's not how it works. You have to grow into this uh, thing. no And that's why um, to get yourself ready for the future, um, the, the best way is to just see the future na. Ngayon na. Dalin mo na yung future sa mundo mo ngayon. In the same way ng unang panahon, meaning eight years ago, bumili yung mga uh, tao ng Tesla, yung unang model na Tesla. So, kung silang nagbadrive ng electric car, pwede din mangyari sa tayo. Because sa, sa mundo ng virtual profession, ang nagbiya atin, pakisabi nga, advantage uh, are the advantage in apps. Sabi nga, advantage in apps. Meron kang hindi alam ang tingin sa'yo ng tao. Paano mo ginawa yan? Yun, di ba? Paano mo nagawa yan? Ikaw naman, bigay-bigay mo yung pangalan ng app. Hindi <laughs> mo alam. Yes, no, magkano pa ang mga digital marketing conferences? Uh, 2,800 dollars, 25,000 pesos, um, 8,000 pesos early bird. And I, I went one, I went to one, uh, this sa Philippines, pero panay foreigners ang speakers. Uh, yeah, halos walang Pinoy. Um, I think the cost was around 14,000 pesos. 14,000 pesos! Um, tapos, um, essentially, what you're gonna learn there, aside from stories by the speakers, is ano ba yung ginagamit nilang app? Okay? Anong app yung pwede nilang pwede mong gamitin sa sarili mong business? O sarili mong, sa date, sa ano, sa sarili mong ginagawa, ano? Dali.
with the first apps. Everybody type the word first apps. And that first app, um, I could have just told you, oh, ito yung app, ganyan. This is the app used by agencies, virtual teams, software developers, NASA, okay, N-A-S-A, -A. okay? gumamit ng mga apps na yan. And usually, will hindi pa yan sikat. Kung konti pa lang may alam. And the people who actually use it, they do not teach it. They do not share it to others. I actually have the same set of apps listed out. I have a secret list. Never shared to anyone. Because sa um, the opportunity to make money from this app will decrease. You get me? So the interested people like you guys who will be joining in the Fantastic Future course. Now, this course is designed exactly just like my Instagram masterclass. So can you ask me the question, I know Instagram masterclass. So, well, actually, we've actually we're all, almost done with the Instagram. Uh, and in there, I spent. Uh, Um, um, half a day. Twenty to forty apps is because I shared apps in Android, and I also would share apps in iPhone. Okay, so in those twenty days, I think one. I don't um because at the time I would share an app, I would also show people how to use the app, and then the second day, you would have everybody using the app on the second but on the second day i would also tell them about a second app you get me tapos on the third day I was using the second app so that's how it was a class now the the secret to this because it's overwhelming is that if you were 
able to miss or miss a session, daily session, okay, daily. This is the type this is daily because I'm explaining how how we did this. Yeah. So if you were able to miss, but today, no, not guns. Today we were busy at work, nag overtime ka, nag file kami reports, na tap ka ng midnight. Hindi ka talaga na kapag bokas ng Instagram mo. Hindi. Um, you, if you Kasi the time requirement, check Instagram to three members ng in confirm nga. How many, how many minutes does it take for you to, te to check out the lessons for the day? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking, uh, I, I spent a few seconds just check post. Eh. So siguro mga three minutes to one minute. So wala kang mas fair minutes. And you were not able to open your Instagram for two mawawalan ka ng hindi makikita yung lesson. So, if you, if for, for two days na magkasunod, hindi ka nagbukas ng Instagram at all, meaning hindi ka nag-CR, hindi ka naghintay kahit kanino at all, um, you will never see the lesson. So, it, it disappears. It helps because tinuman sila sa brain na member yan in five minutes a day, nag-aaral yan five minutes minutes a day on apps. So, really, you know, alam mo ang 20, 20 apps para makagawa ng magandang Instagram account. Tama ba? Depende kung naka-Android ka, naka-iPhone ka, 40 ang alam mong apps. Pero, the point there is not to know just the apps. Use the apps. Alangan ba? Papakita mo na marunong ka gumamit ng apps. And this is all smartphone-based. So that's how we. So I would we wouldn't do so. Panay working kami ng anong office hours, ah, office office days lang, Monday to Friday lang. Tapos um, breaks on Saturday, Sunday. So that process enabled us to to learn a lot, di ba? Nang five minutes a day, ganon <laughs> minutes a day na checking the work. Tapos maraming natutunan yung mga ano, yung mga tao yung mga students ng Instagram mark masterclass so that's the basis of your course no? um that you would learn a few apps ngayon ito hindi nga lang ako magtuturo ng 40 apps no kasi it's not about uh, a single app that does one thing the fantastic future course an app one specific thing well pero maraming details, maraming in-depth. Like yung share ko sa inyo, um, I'm gonna tell everyone, the the app that I shared first is Slack, S-L-A-C-K, which used, para siyang Facebook Messenger, it's either better than WhatsApp, better than um, WeChat, compared it all. Eh. I compared it all. App used by NASA, you know, to put somebody to space or to bring space by all your faith companies. <coughs> so, for those of you who are not please go to com slash new or new virtual careers group so that you can experience what I already shared the first app and this all other virtual professionals because most of the clients want to work with them using Slack. Ito yung favorite nilang chat na tool. And there's a reason for that. And right now, I'm revealing slowly to the people who go join that group. It's a, Slack is free to join. My group is free to join. Para ma-experience nyo, ano ba yung meron dito kaya ginagamit ito ng mga virtual careers clients. Diba? Now, that, uh, that alone is valuable, but I would like to tell you all about the Fantastic Future course because it's going to be a very valuable sa arsenal ninyo. Kayo ng peak in what 
should you be instead yung ginagamit. Now, I've never period not even shared masterminds because I want to want to have book photos alam ko na yan no, I am not interested in those kinds I'm interested in people who buy ang gagawin natin format sa Fantastic Future Course I'll give you okay I'll show you how it's done and then you have to show me how it's done also I've been emailed I am a testimony member of the class all worth it di ba Ah, by the way, no, tama si Melvin. Even in the first instant Instagram class, Melvin, while in the Instagram masks, which is really, really long, but 20 days, 20 days may kliyente na agad. Gusto magmadali. In 20 days, magaling ka na mag-Instagram. Pero kulang ka sa time. Kasi wala ka masyadong experience before those 20 days. Tapos may client dekla, boom! Anong gagawin mo? Panic. Because you know, I'm very with him. To build comes to so, meron ka lang ibigay na sa ginagawa mo hindi lang yung okay in 3 days magpahiyahar niya ako tapos papagawa siya sa akin pero sa totoo lang wala ka na nabibigay sa inyo ng oras kailangan Instagram ka talaga if you, you know 40 apps on how to execute those apps but you do need the time to practice it, right? Diba kami? Mr. Brina. Si Sabrina din, Memma. Now, I'm the 20 day class because we're no longer accepting members. Not yet. Not anymore. You see, because that's 20 days. Each month is the fantastic future course willing to join. Okay, you how to join? Excited to learn more about this fantastic future course. Please type the word, I am ready to join. So, you know, this is very, very exciting. This is exciting. There is eyes of the so it's hurry up and answer answer that uh, question to you John um, I will answer that quickly but I will do the answer the fantastic future course is a bonus to the date with freedom and so for the date with freedom the na summit and you can join by joining live or you can join online by getting the videos um i'm going to give it to those who will get the videos because premium for this is a new bonus for the date with freedom okay date with freedom. the premium seat is 9575 it will gives you one month fantastic future na course okay now, the Fantastic Future course is a continuing monthly course. Right? Now, if you get the VIP Dream or Dreams, uh, that's 19.5. That will give you three months of Fantastic Future course for free, included na yan, Okay. So, this is on top of doing getting everything that's in the Date with Freedom the course or summit. Okay? You get to attend. For the OFW, here's a brand new bonus. Everybody, the word brand new bonus. Enroll ka na, pasa ko na, <laughs> Sabrina. Pero ka one month na ano na fantastic future course. Now the course 
the it's a monthly all you are here This is in Manila, North W, and you cannot attend, right? I am going to allow you to send someone else to attend for you. Asawa mo, halimbawa, yan, ganyan. Sobrang makakatulong yan sa relationship mo kung love one mo. will attend and they can just talk about it uh, on the internet uh, um. let's say for example their app and you can just join there a month so uh, valid only using credit cards obviously go to datewithfreedom.com and go get that okay 
So now this other people to talk about their experiences regarding watch out for it 3 p.m and on wednesday and 9 p.m on wednesday we have another set of webinars this week din yon okay so bumabagal na daw internet ko so i just have to finish up and hurry up okay so what did we cover today can can somebody just review help me review So you found out she hires virtual professionals, but she offers an admin, uh, the virtual assistant, assistants also, and meet her in the date with free. Um, uh, event. And you get pasado kayo, okay lang. Now I'm telling you na Brother Arun told us the memories of your children have to be in their, have to be in the memories of your children you have to be in their lives today. The best way to train, this is my last live training for basic stuff, um, but the summit for, and I'm giving you, you are going to receive a brand new bonus of course one month access so it's just gonna be just like marketing phone you give five minutes and you learn something new for you to join the other months at the discount. Okay, the looks. Uh, kung gusto mong kunin yung three months, you have to enroll in the VIP. And the dream. So, the last one is Sabrina. And that's, that's where it's Ayun. So, uh, Brad, somebody who the live event. Just to remind you, the name first. Uh, 
so they can attend. There are four live events, four live events for for date with Burr, the live event October 14, tapos uh, so small price for you. but you get they get right They can be big brand new announcements. Wednesday, 3 p.m. and 9 p.m. Tell them to attend the webinar. Again. Here's the link to the actual sales page so you could find the details. So that's all the time we got for today. Thank you so much, uh, Andrea. I saw Andrea Annaline for you soon next week. And thank you for everyone to for, I encourage other people to join and check out this webinar, uh, especially those uh, in marketing. Um, you check so you can make the most of it. Okay? Thank you, everyone. Uh, God bless. Please do live a marvelous life because you do deserve it. Right? God bless.